Hey guys, it's Mrs. Antones giving you some answers for minute five. Number one says the area of the shape is nine square units. True or false? Well, a square unit is just one of these little squares. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. This says nine, but we actually have twelve. So that'd be false. Number two, three times five is 15. Which number is the product? The product is basically the answer when you're multiplying. So our product here would be 15. 68 minus five, eight minus five is three, six minus nothing is nothing, six. So we have 63. Carol wants to buy six pens, that's why we have a six here, for 75 cents each, which we write exactly like this, 0 0.75. How much money does she need to buy the pens? If you do six times five, you get 30. There's our three, the zero goes down here. Six times seven is 42, and now we add that three. So 42 plus three, is 45. So she would need $4.50. Number five. 21 plus six. Six plus one is seven. Two plus nothing is two. So we would end up with 27. The expanded form of 489 is, so remember that's when we're adding some zeros. So if in expanded form, we would have four, zero, zero, 400 plus eight. And instead of a nine right there, we would put a zero. So 400 plus 80 plus nine. There's nothing after nine, so we don't add any zeros there. So if you did add these up, 400 plus 80 plus nine, you would get that 489. Write the value of the underlined digit. So we have a number five. That would give you 50, but saying how many tens is it? 50 is five tens. That means five times 10 is 50. 70 is seven tens. So seven times 10 is 70.